Hi, this is Alex from Groovy Entertainment. Today we got another book on record episode to do. Today's book is The Wizard of Oz. And with the same other books, there's no year to it. So it's year from 73 or 74. If you know the year, you can leave it in the comments. So let's get started. Hello, girls and boys. I'm your Peter Pan storyteller. When you hear this sound, you turn the page. Now, let's read the story together. Here we go. The Wizard of Oz. We're on our way, we're on our way to visit the land of Oz. The most exciting, delighting, and bounding visit there ever was. Cause it is, it is, it is, it is the home, the home of the wonderful Wiz, the Wiz, the Wiz, the Wiz, the Wiz, the wonderful Wizard of Oz. Once upon a time, on the Great Plains of Kansas, a little girl named Dorothy lived with her Aunt Em. One day, as Dorothy was walking home with her little dog, Toto, a huge cyclone came roaring down toward her. Quick, Toto, into this house. We'll be safe here. But just as she closed the door, the cyclone picked up the house and sent it spinning through the air, round and round, higher and higher. Suddenly, she fell down, unconscious. Hours later, she awakened as the house landed with a bump. She stepped outside, and there stood some strange little people. Who are you? And where am I? We're a happy bunch of munchkins. We're here to welcome you to the land of Oz. And why? Because we like you. Sure do. Oz? I never heard of it. But can you tell me how to get back to Kansas? Only the wizard can do that. Who? The wizard. The Wizard of Oz. See that yellow brick road? Follow it to Emerald City, and you'll find him there. Oh, thank you. Come on, Toto. We're on our way, we're on our way to visit the Wizard of Oz. A little way down the yellow brick road, she was startled when a scarecrow said, Hello there. Who are you? I'm Dorothy, and I'm going to Emerald City to see the wizard. Would you take me with you? Maybe the wizard will give me a brain instead of straw under my hat. I'll be glad to take you. Let's go. We're on our way, we're on our way to visit the Wizard of Oz. Down the yellow brick road they went, singing happily, when suddenly they heard a strange creaking noise. It's the Tin Woodman. Oh, the poor thing. He's all rusty. He needs oil. She oiled him up and he thanked her. When she told him where she was going, the Tin Woodman said, Oh, can I come too? Maybe the wizard will give me a heart. Of course you can. Let's go. On they went, but as they were passing through the woods, a big lion suddenly jumped out and roared at them, frightening the Tin Woodman and the Scarecrow and Toto. This angered Dorothy and she slapped his face. To their surprise, the lion started to cry. I'm just a cowardly lion trying to find some courage. I didn't mean any harm. Oh, poor lion. Come with us. Perhaps the wizard will give you courage. Oh, thank you. I will come. At last, Dorothy and her friends reached Emerald City and knocked on the door of the wizard's palace. Turn the record over, and we'll continue. Here we are on the second side of the record. Let's read together again. Who dares disturb the mighty wizard? They were so frightened, they almost ran away. But Dorothy hurriedly explained why they had come. Then hear this. Destroy my enemy, the Wicked Witch of the West, and your wishes shall be granted. But the Wicked Witch was following their every move in her crystal ball. <laughs> Destroy me, will you? Summoning her army of winged monkeys, she said, Bring that Dorothy and her friends here to my castle. 
before they knew what was happening, the Tin Woodman, Scarecrow, and Lion found themselves in the dungeon. Poor Dorothy, ordered to scrub every floor in the gloomy old castle, thought of home and began to cry. Oh, Anne M., where are you? Somewhere there's sunshine and laughter. Somewhere birds sing all day through. Somewhere all oh, that's where I wish I were. Somewhere out there with you. This infuriated the witch. Stop that sniveling or I'll give you something to really cry about. Suddenly Toto bit her on the leg. In a rage, the witch struck Toto. Dorothy became so angry, she threw a bucket of water at her. And the witch screamed, Why did you do that? I'm melting away! Melting away! And the wicked witch did melt completely away, leaving only her silver shoes. Dorothy put on the silver shoes, released her friends, and they all hurried back to the wizard. Your brave actions prove that you, Scarecrow, now have a real brain. And you, Tin Woodman, have a good heart. And you, Lion, have true courage. As for you, Dorothy, just wish, and your magic silver shoes will take you home. Oh, I wish, I wish. And goodbye, dear friend. And soon, she was back in Kansas, home again with dear Aunt Em. And that's the wonderful story of the wonderful Wizard of Oz. So that was the Wizard of Oz. So I hope you liked the video a lot. Please like, subscribe, share, comment, and have a groovy day. And our next book will be Popeye I Love on Troubled Water.